Hey everyone, so apparently Venom may not be rated R after all. We first heard about this at San Diego Comic-Con, where Tom Hardy, who's playing Eddie Brock, said this could be the first movie that he could take his kid to. I wanted to do something that, uh, I really wanted to do something that my son could watch, you know, because of a lot of the films that I've done are normally pretty aggressive or violent, or I swear a lot, or, you know, you know. The director on this film also stated that the movie had not yet been rated, meaning they really weren't pushing for that R rating to begin with. Well today, Variety has reported that it's becoming more and more unlikely that this will be the first rated R Sony Marvel movie. The studio is reportedly doing this so future Spider-Man spinoffs can retain their family friendliness? I don't know. And potentially cross over with the MCU. So for me personally, I don't really mind the PG-13 rating. I don't think it's really necessary for a character like Venom. I mean, sure, it would make the action a little bit better and bloodier, but I don't think it's as important as people are making it out to be. Like, Deadpool, for example, needs that R rating because that's just who the character is. The jokes he makes are edgy, whereas Venom has never really been that hard R character. But with that said, I've just never personally been into this movie at all. Venom has never been my favorite villain or anti-hero, even in the Spider-Man universe. I've just never found the character that interesting, and the fact that Spider-Man isn't even in this movie makes it even less interesting, at least to me. Sony, as a studio, don't really have the best track record either. I would argue that Spider-Man 1 and 2 are the only good movies that they have under their belt, the Amazing Spider-Man 1 is decent, but it's just an origin story told in a somewhat different way. It's just not really that good. I feel like Spider-Man 1 does it way better. But that's just personal preference. For me, they really haven't made a good movie in like 14 years. Now, that's not to say I'm not going to watch this movie. I am, and I really hope it's good. I mean, why would I want this movie to be bad? That doesn't make any sense. But from what I've seen so far, there's just nothing that's really getting me excited about this movie. Venom looks cool, but I have a feeling we'll only see him for like the last 20 minutes of this movie. Again, I hope I'm wrong and this movie is awesome, but we'll just have to wait and see on October 5th.